maybe there is a big plan here that's that's coming together. It's not a bad one. The bodega will be there for Danny Limelight. This kind of nullifies them. Truly a people's champ and a world champ. We don't just say world champ for no reason, but we say it because people from all over the world have lined up to take a shot at that title, and Danny Limelight has retained it each and every time. I don't know if I've seen a group of tree clearers that would rival the group around this ring of lumberjacks right now. Just a murderer's row of big, tough fellas. And I do not envy either of these guys if they find themselves outside of the ring in this one, a huge main event. If you're just tuning in and you're noticing your palms are a little sweaty and your heart beats right in a little beating a little faster, it's because it's a main event for the world title and it's a lumberjack match. And this might be one of the biggest ones we've ever had. Two guys who hate each other round two. Neither of them want to leave with a loss. Both of them want to leave with the title. Clearwater's a former champion for a reason. The guy is smart and he's basically your prototypical wrestler. He's big, he's fast, he's strong. He's very intelligent in that ring. He just happens to be a jerk. No one likes to live off of other people's work more than Jordan Clearwater. And you gotta give him points for resourcefulness. Yeah, he had Invictus Cash, Cash is gone. He had Talos, now Talos is gone. He had Nana, now Nana's gone. Yet he still finds a way to have a team with him at ringside. But that's not enough to stop Danny Limelight, the champion, firing back. 99% of the time, when your opponent is on a roll, rolling out of the ring to safety is a good move. But on a night like tonight, when the title's on the line in a lumberjack match, it's just more dangerous than ever. Really the antithesis of everything that Jordan Clearwater is. Listen, no one says the middle of the ring's the hardest part of the ring, but it's the most dangerous. It's far away from the ropes. It's far away from safety. And Danny Limelight has to fight and claw for every inch to get to that rope. Danny Limelight, surrounded by Lumberjacks, had to take on the institution, had to take on TMZ, and had to take on the Golden Boy. It's not plan A, it's plan B, and that's what got Danny Limelight to win here. Heart and a backup plan.